what's going on guys, this is Andrew Chicken and welcome back to another video. Today we are playing Buck, who is a champion who has not really appeared on my channel for quite a long time. I mean, I think last time I played him was like June or something. Uh, and I've only ever made like two videos on this guy, so you would need to show him a bit more love. You know, he got a gold skin recently with Radiant Stars and I've barely taken it out. I mean, I got to level 50 before Radiant Stars and then I just barely used this skin since. And it's a decent skin, alright? I mean, like, it's not the best golden skin in the world, but it is still a pretty nice golden skin. Uh, it looks better than Shaolin's at any rate, so yeah, we might as well use it. Uh, let's see, what do we got on our team here? We got a Ying, Sky, Barrack, Knesset. We are on Frog Isle. So, this should be pretty interesting. It's a decent map for Buck, I guess. Of course, you know, you can make any map a decent map for Buck. Except, Timbermill is kind of weird, but, eh, I, we'll just forget that one exists. <laughs> uh, so yeah, Buck, uh, I mean, I, I love playing this champion, but I've kind of been neglecting him recently in favor of, you know, Eevee and, uh, Eevee and Eevee. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I might, it might feel a little bit weird playing this guy again, honestly, because I'm so used to, like, dashing around, soaring around, teleporting, flick shots, all that fun stuff. I've been having a lot of fun on Eevee, man, so, yeah, I guess we're going kind of back to a, a less intensive playstyle with Buck, because he's not nearly as intense as Eevee is, uh, but he's still a lot of fun. So let's see, what are we going up against? We have a Strix, of course, it's Frog Isle, of course, we have to have a sniper, you know, sniper battle. It's just a, it's a really campy, you know, sort of sniper map, so it makes sense to have that there. They also have a Grover, who might shut down my bounce house a little bit with his cripple. That could be annoying. They have Makoa Khan, two tanks, all right, that's fine, and a Koga. All right, so I'll probably just go for the usual bounce house sort of playstyle thing, you know, just bounce on the Strix, pop him up into the air, do 1,300 bursts, and then just kill him, hopefully, because <laughs> that's a pretty good way to take out snipers, and it's also a pretty good way to take out flanks, because he's sort of an anti-flank, you know, he's a big boy, got a lot of self-sustain, got a shotgun he's scary so uh yeah this should be hopefully a good game for us but if it's not a good game for us then well i'm just i've been i've gotten bad at buck apparently <laughs> i don't know so uh bounce house let's go with that let's go my leap build i've kind of reworked this a little bit i used to run exhilarate five and stomping ground at five and it's sort of problematic when you do that because uh, you end up getting more cooldown reduction than is actually the cooldown of your Heroic Leap, because Exhilarate, uh, it reduces the cooldown by 5 seconds if you have that maxed out, so that is 50% of the cooldown. Then if you get a kill, Stomp Ground reduces it by another 75% for a total of 125% cooldown reduction, which is a little bit silly. So, I've cranked that down to 2, uh, so that's 20% plus 75% is 95% reduction, it's pretty much instant. Uh, and that way we can divert our points to other cards, like Momentum for damage reduction, Leg Day for Leg Jump Strength, because I like that. And a little bit of rapid sustain, I guess it's a filler, we don't have points in that. So let's get Leap, let's get Cauterize, let's get Illuminate for the Strix, and let's go hopefully frag out. We need to go kill, kill the Sniper, help our Knesset. And of course we are being assisted by a Sky, so yeah, Strix, Strix should be fearing for his life. Alright, let's see, let's just, let's just jump in, hello, bye. <laughs> Alright, ooh, and you're dead, nice. Uh, let's jump over here, didn't quite land the Bounce House, but that's okay, there we go, we can help finish him. And I don't have a jump, unfortunately. I didn't get the killing blow. Hopefully this guy can help get the Strix. Where did he go? He's like over here, isn't he? Um, ooh, there's Koga there. Yeah, I'm, I probably push forward a little bit. Let's recovery right now, because we're about to get shot. Okay, nice. Strix is dead. Yeah, let's just let's just force him back through here, you know? Uh, give me, give me my five bullets again. Yeah, let's just... Let's beat him back. Oh, hi, Makoa. What do you think you're doing? You better not hook me. Ooh, yeah, please don't. Okay, Sky. Sky's dropped. That's unfortunate, but we did beat them back long enough that we are going to capture that objective pretty much effortlessly, so that's nice. And there we go, dead Makoa! Ow! <laughs> ah, that grip hurt, but at least we got headshots on the Makoa. You know, it's already easy to hit headshots with Buck, and then of course Makoa has the fattest head hitbox in the world, so... You know, it is really, really easy to get headshots on him. We left him on, like, 20 HP, then finished him off. So that was pretty nice. Uh, oh, Barrack, you're in danger. Barrack, no! <laughs> okay, let's just group up. Ooh, Sky's ulting out. Is that gonna kill anybody? Oh my gosh, that actually got a kill. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna help push in then, Sky. You have earned my trust. Uh, oh, what the heck? I saw, like... Well, first of all, I lagged, but then I saw, like, a little red hitbox there for a second. I was like, no way Strix is pushing. And then Strix pushed. And I'm dead. Wow, holy crap, that was a lot of damage. Somehow I took 2,000 damage from Koga. Interesting. Well, uh, I guess that was a bad play then. Now uh, let's just head back in there. I want to go, like, right side and then just jump on Strix again. Ooh, Koga just got a double kill. Okay, uh, maybe we should fall back. Uh, yeah, Ying is dead. Barrick, 
Barrick, you're the only one up there. Run away. We gotta regroup. We gotta regroup with the team. Oh, what the heck are you doing? What the? What? What the heck was that? <laughs> what? I just got flanked by an invisible Strix. What the heck? I have never seen that. Like, at all. I've never seen that in my life. A Strix do that. Just, you know push up way past his team and go flank buck and now i'm dead again but what the heck was that play i mean it worked but like how <laughs> why would you ever do that that is so weird okay well um ooh, they're just they're so grouped up there how am i supposed to push in against that eric is almost dead um i know what i can do i can okay i can not even help with the strix or help with the koga they're both just dead before I can even do anything. Alright. Well, um... Bop. Bop. Oh, Kness is ulting for some reason. Alright, and Grover's ulting their tanks. It's a little bit risky pushing it against them. Alright. Oh, man. Sky's ulting too? Well, there we go. We can knock you up in the sky. I wanted to kill on Makoa. There we go. We can get the kill on you. Get the reset. There we go. Pounce on you. And Sky stole my kill. How freaking dare you? I need the cooldown reset. There. I'll steal your kill. How about that, eh? Alright. Well, we managed to retake control of the point. We gotta go zone them, keep them in their spawn. Hello, Makoko. You looking for a hook? Uh, he might have been. Ooh, Kanessa just destroyed Strix somehow. I don't even know how that happened, but good job. Alright, and headshot on you. Bop! I'm Olsen. Ah! Oh, Makoko, you're one. There we go. And nice, team's got my back. There we go. Alright. Uh, we should have this. We should definitely have this. There's no way Strix is gonna <laughs> save this entire point. There he is. Illuminate! Helpful! Yes! Got him! <laughs> Alright, and there we go. Push successful. Oh my goodness, he actually, he actually just wasted his ult, and he didn't even kill me with it. Okay, nice job, Khan. You are, you are very intelligent. <laughs> okay, let's get, uh, let's get more Illuminate so we don't get freaking flanked by Strix. That's such a weird feeling. I've, I've never been flanked by a Strix like that. Point blank, he literally didn't even scope in on me. He just got within melee range and shot me down. And of course, I wasn't looking his direction because I was, like, looking over the wall, so I didn't see him coming in. That was... I mean, props to Strix for that play, but at the same time, that is the most unorthodox Strix I've ever seen. <laughs> and, I mean, I don't think it's working out too well for them because we're 2-0 right now. Um, so I'm 15-4. and four. I guess let's uh, just keep doing what we're doing, keep killing stuff. We're on a 9 streak. Let's uh, try not to lose that streak, but let's try and grow it instead. So, uh, to the right, I imagine Khan will be over here again. We don't have to worry about a Khan ult at all, so that's really good for me. Okay, hello Khan. Yeah, don't don't focus on me. Please, no, stop. I'm trying to shoot freaking Grover. There we go, we interrupted his dash. And what was that? I think I got hooked and grabbed at the same time. This is such a weird game. Alright. I just, I want to I wanna beat up the Koga. Koga, can you come here? No, die! Oh, Sky stole my freaking kill, and I'm gonna die because I don't have a jump to get out of here. Thanks, Sky. Look, Sky, you literally killed me there because you didn't let me get my kill. Oh, come on. Gee, I, like, this is so dependent on me getting kills with Stomping Ground because it's a 75% cooldown reduction. It's literally the biggest cooldown reduction card in the game uh, on kill effect. And, you know, I can't kind of assist for that. It, it leaves no rooms for assist. It has to be killing blow. So Sky stealing my Koga kill right there, that literally killed me because if I had gotten that kill, I would have been able to jump away from the tanks. Who just crowd controlled me to death? So, all right. Uh, pause. Reload. Grover. Okay. Um. Grover's dead. Um. Okay. I gotta get out of here. What the heck? Why am I dead? Wait. Str I thought Strix died. Wait. <laughs> okay. Strix is dead. Okay. I don't know what's going on in this game. This is just weird. Okay. Uh. Let's just let's just group up. Sky got a kill on the Koga, and Grover's dead. Nice. At least my teammates are killing stuff. Although they are stealing my kills too, which I don't like. Um, let's see, we could jump in maybe, well, I don't want to jump in on the Makoa, because he just likes to hook me, and kind of likes to grab me, and they both like to do it simultaneously, and then I just die. You know what, we could kill the Koga, though. Hello! Oh, nice dash. There we go, we got him. Easy kill. Uh, let's go, let's go jump in on Grover. Hello. Oh, yep, there's the grab and the hook again, which means I went nowhere. Okay, I need to heal, I need to heal, I need to heal, I need to get out of here. Oh, I'm alive. Okay. Wait, what the heck is Strix? Strix just tried to flank our Kinesa. What the heck is this man doing? All right. Um, well, we can fire over Khan's shield. And let's jump in. That's a kill. There we go. Got our stomping ground. Got our reset. 
Oh, okay. Okay, Grover. You're gonna solo ult me? I see how it is. Let's just... There we go. Headshot on you. Bop. And... Oh, kill stolen. Okay, that means I can't push in on the Strix now. Look what you've done, team! Where did he go? Where did he go? Oh, okay, he's gone. Well, victory. Nice. Alright, that was a pretty decent game. That was a very, very weird game. I mean, apparently if you get grabbed and you get hooked by Makoa at the same time, you just end up going nowhere. That was that was really, really strange. That happened to me multiple times that game for some reason. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the stats. We got 11 kills, 59,000 damage, so we did manage to outperform our Kinesa, thankfully. Uh, not quite outperforming our Sky, though. She did more damage, got more kills than I did. Uh, and died one fewer times. I died a lot that game. Six deaths? That is way more than anyone else on my team. Like, three deaths from Kinesa, three deaths from Barrick, three deaths from Ying. I mean, the other one close to me was Sky, so I was <laughs> I was getting bullied a lot that game, but we still did manage to perform pretty well. That Strix was so strange. I am... <laughs> he got 11,000 damage, two kills, and one of them was me. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, dying to a melee Strix who flanked me. That was such a weird, unorthodox tactic, and that definitely did not pay off. The Koga was definitely doing good, and the tanks were, you know, crowd-controlling me into oblivion. Um, I feel like they were put back a little bit by their Strix, who was just deciding not to snipe for whatever reason. That was a really... That was a really, really weird game. But, anyways... Ooh, hey, uh, Maz... Mazaka, 04. Mazaka? Mazaka? Hey, the sky! Uh, hey, ha, shout out to you. Hello, Andrew. I'm Sub. Love your videos. Paladins. Thank you. Have a heart. And, uh, yeah, also, hi. <laughs> Alright, but I think that is going to be the end of the video. I just wanted to, you know, bring out Buck, break out the Buck Gold skin a little bit more because I barely used this, and, you know, give, give him another video on the channel because we don't have too many Buck videos. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss an upload from me. Also, join the Discord server, link in the description, to pick up tips, leave suggestions, and become a part of our active community. Also, huge, huge out to the members to help make this uh, channel possible. I really, really appreciate all your support. And if you want to become a member today, then just click the join button right next to the subscribe button. Anyways, I will see you all next time. Peace out.